SpaceX's Starship offshore platforms, Phobos and Deimos, are former deepwater oil drilling rigs. In January 2021, SpaceX began modifying them to support launch and landing of their next-generation launch vehicle, Starship. SpaceX CEO Elon Musk first showed offshore launch and landing platforms for Starship in a 2017 animation of the Earth-to-Earth -Earth passenger carrying use case. More recently, Musk clarified in June 2020 that offshore platforms would be used both for launches into space, post-launch landings, and for the more long-term Earth-to-Earth transportation. In July 2020, Lone Star Mineral Development LLC, a subsidiary of SpaceX, bought two semi-submersible drilling rigs from Valaris PLC for $3.5 million US dollars each. They were renamed Phobos and Deimos after the two moons of Mars. The drilling platforms had previously been named Ensco slash Valaris 8500 and 8501, respectively, and were nearly identical as built and when purchased by SpaceX. In January 2021, Phobos was moved from the port of Galveston to Pascagoula, Mississippi to begin refit of the rig for Starship operation by removal of the oil rig equipment. A planned six-month project as of July 2021 the rig has been cleared of the bulk of the old equipment on its deck. In February 2021, Musk stated that one of the platforms may be partially operational by the end of 2021, and that in order to be transported to the platform's starships would fly out to sea and land on the platform. In February 2021, Musk stated that the platforms would eventually be used for landing and launch operations in 2022. In February 2022, Musk indicated that one of the two platforms would have a launch tower installed by the end of the year.